No, Jeremy, you can't do this. They are just children. Hey guys, what's up, and welcome back to Roblox Jumbo, and in today's video, we're going to be talking about how Roblox YouTuber Jeremy forced young children to do this. And you may be wondering, well, what is this? Well, we'll start talking about it. But if you are new to this video, make sure to go ahead and click that subscribe button with post notifications on, because we post weekly Roblox content, and it'd be a shame if you miss out on any of it. Anyways, without further ado, guys, let's go ahead and jump right into today's brand new Roblox video. But before we start talking about what he did, we should probably get into who he is. So, who is Jeremy? Jeremy, also known as Jeremy in real life, or just Jeremy, is a Roblox YouTuber with over 1.6 million subscribers. He mainly uploads content centered around the game Adopt Me. His group, Jeremy, has over 150,000 members. Jeremy got his account, Jerema, terminated in late December of 2019 because he bought pets for USD, aka money. Nearly one year after the creation of Jerema, he recorded a video where he was on an alternate account. Jerema claimed that he got banned 36 hours before uploading the video, and he posted the video on December 21st of 2019, two days after his termination was finally revealed to the public. He is also well known for his conflict with Adopt Me. In early 2020, he was called out by the Adopt Me team for buying pets with real money, which is against both Roblox Terms of Service and Adopt Me's Terms of Service. As a result, he got his account banned from the game. Jerema continued to play on Adopt Me with different accounts, refusing to honor the ban that was given to his main account. Anybody who played Adopt Me with Jerema on his video got temporarily banned from the game as well. Anyways, considering all the facts, he is not the nicest guy as he encourages fans to do very bad things and YouTube honestly should get to the bottom of this before he takes control of a lot of them, which would be pretty upsetting anyways. So what does he force them to do? Well, he actually forces them to cuss. He was telling them if they cussed, they would be getting free stuff from him. So he hoped on a Discord server with his friends and they got on a voice chat and basically he told them that if they swore and cussed, they would be getting free stuff. We don't know what the free things would be, but telling a child to cuss and swear is just plain wrong and stupid. It would cause problems with the kid and the parent. According to an article titled, My policy on swearing is that they are just words, and I allow my kid to swear as long as it's not disrespectful, is what she wrote. They will get in trouble for telling someone to shut up, but I could care less if they lo lose a S word when they stub their toe or something. But that is just one mother's opinion though. Other research has found that children start swearing around age 2 and it becomes more adult-like by ages 11 or 12. Authors at the Association for Psychological Science noted in 2012, by the time children enter school, they have a working vocabulary of 30 to 40 offensive words, the report continued. So why is it bad for kids to curse? Most of the time we are uncomfortable when our kids are angry. We move in to shut them down and having them mad and swearing would just make things even worse. The free use of swear words is like a rite of passage, like getting a driver's license or drinking alcohol. We wouldn't want them doing those things either, would we? Well, taking all of that into consideration, he should not be encouraging it whatsoever because it's wrong, because once they start saying it, it's gonna become a very bad habit for them. And like that study said earlier, if kids start swearing at a younger age, they will probably have a working vocabulary whenever they enter school of 30 to 40 offensive words. That is honestly pretty bad to see anywhere, so in all honesty, we hope that kids don't start swearing, and we hope that he stops encouraging them for that. What do you think is going to be going on with this? Please tell us your thoughts down in the comment section below, because we are interested to hear. Well, anyways guys, thank you all so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure to go ahead and slap the like button on this very video, and if you think we missed anything on this story going on, please comment down below and do let us know. Anyways guys, it has been Roblox Jumbo, and we thank you all so much for watching today's video. Peace out everybody, have a great day, and bye bye